Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 758, where we have 40 moves to clear out 48 jelly. So I've got double thick jelly over here, I've got single thick over here, I've got a frog on the board to help me, and he can be very, very helpful. Right now I can turn him into a color bomb. And then what I want to do is probably unwrap this side. Actually, right now the chocolate can't grow. This is going to be static for a while. So let's work on this board. We'll work on this side until we can't, and then we'll switch over to here. The crevices are going to be particularly difficult to get rid of. Uh, if I take out all orange from the board, I concentrate the colors down. Oops, I opened that side up by using the frog, but I turned him into a stripe. Isn't he cute? I just love that frog. I want to reach in and get the stuff right around this chocolate spawner if I can. Because once it covers over, it's hard to see that there's jelly there and it just, you know, you're doubling the work. Okay, so it's gone from this area and it's almost gone from this area. I've got the frog filled and I've gotten a lot of stuff done here. I would love to try to make a color bomb with these green. I don't see it happening, but it didn't hurt to give it an attempt. And then when I make these moves, I hope that I create some cascading opportunities. Ooh, nice. And I just kind of peck away at this over and over. I can do this, which will also cut through here and make some changes for me. Now notice I've got the frog and I haven't used him yet. There are a couple of reasons. One is that, um, well, there are three reasons that I can think of. The first one is that I don't know exactly where I'm going to need him. And he might be more valuable to me on this side of the board or on this side of the board. So I'm waiting to see where I'm having trouble. The second reason is he actually requires a move. He used to not on the old platform, but now if I move him, he takes up one of my turns. I don't like that so much. And then another reason is that he's hard to fill because it's hard to make a color bomb on this board. So after I move him, he's kind of stuck where I put him for a while, probably. All right, so I've got some fun things here. If I can set that off, it can take this out. So I'm going to stay over on this side for a while here. See what I can do to try to clear this out. Keep the chocolate at bay. Oh, maybe I can get another blue through here. A uh, nope. I'm going to move the green out of the, the frog out of the way so I can try to make some moves over here. Oh, we got a little bit going on. And now I'm a bit stuck here. I could move him to right here, which would be pretty good because it would change the board, but then I would have this frog stuck in the corner. I still like it because I've got two shots at getting rid of this. One is to work here directly and one is to get this set off. And I needed to change this because I was running out of moves I had available. Still running out of moves I have available. Shoot. I'm not going to take out the chocolate here. I kind of like the chocolate to grow on this side. The more the chocolate grows on this side, the more likely I'll get a reshuffle and reshuffles can be super handy. Another thing that can be handy is making a special that can slice over here to change what the board looks like. So I'm trying to draw that through. I've got this taken care of now. So let's see if I can just make moves here that create the cascade I need. Ugh. Come on. So close here. Oh, so close. we made it. I was ready to just jump in and start over again. Okay, so this was my second playthrough actually for uh, recording purposes, and I was close the first time around too. This is a, a board I think that would respond really well to bringing in boosters if you have that opportunity. If you'd like to see more videos, you can subscribe. If you um, want to yell at me because I got lucky on the last move, go ahead and put those comments in the bottom section. I understand luck is part of this game, and as always, thanks so much for watching.